Dave from Muskoka Bros here. We're doing a review. We were at the outdoor adventure show yesterday. I picked up one of these Agawa Canyon saws. Agua. Agua. Agawa. I'm totally new to this, so this is like one of my third times kind of getting this set up. So, so it kind of goes into joint here and then it snaps in. And honestly, it's very lightweight. They, there's a demonstration. The guy was nice enough to let us uh, film a demonstration, which we will uh, we'll probably be posting on this. All right, so I would like to introduce you to our Boreal 21. 21 inches and it's a mean cutting machine. And uh, the distinction of this is the ease of setup. With one hand, or two hands, and one motion, you can set it up into operation, no moving parts, fully tensioned, and ready to cut. I'm about to show you the action. I won't finish it. That blade, we offer a combination of four different blades. This is the Sydney Impressive. It's the preferred blade for people who are experienced in the woods. You can really cut through wood like butter. That's the comments we've heard on the website. But we have other ones. We have ones for dry wood. Uh, if, you, if you're around the house and everything, all the wood seasoned, we have a, uh, this is a stainless steel bone for rendering in the bush. And then we have our all purpose, which is a standard product, which is good for all kinds of things. So I'll close out, I'll reduce it to its closed position, ready to be packed in our sheets, which we have two styles, the canvas, which is preferred for uh, canoeists, and this rugged, crazy horse pull of leather. Thank you. And, uh, I'm just gonna kind of demonstrate a bit. This is uh, the Agawa Canyon Coral Axe 21. Uh, the guys were nice enough to talk to me. Uh, the one guy's from Uxbridge. This is made in Canada. Very lightweight. It ran me about $80 with tax. Maybe a bit more than that. Can't remember the full price, but it came with an extra blade. I think, I don't know if that was like a promotional thing at the conference, at the outdoor show but it's amazing, it folds up really nice and neat, light, slip it in your pack, you're ready to go. I haven't used it too much yet, but you'll probably see uh, any of us using this in upcoming videos. Uh, yeah, so I, I give it a 10 out of 10, but that's inexperienced talking. I haven't tried a wide range of these. It cut very, very nice, very sharp. It's a really good quality saw. Yeah, so in conclusion, good saw, buy it. It's all for me today.